Hey guys, thank you for back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing part two of my CLC music video reaction marathon. For those of you who haven't checked out part one, make sure to go check out part one because I saw all of their early, like the first two years of their music videos. I uh, re-reacted to them. For those of you who don't know, I'm a CLC stan, so I've already seen all these music videos, but I figured I would do a little music video reaction marathon for them, as well as my old boy group, One Us, um, since I haven't seen the music videos in so long. So um, today we're gonna be checking out Hobgoblin, Where Are You? And then their B-sides, I Like It, and To The Sky. I hope you guys enjoy, and yeah. This is start. All right, so we're gonna be going in chronological order of when they were released. So we're gonna be going to do Hobgoblin first. Go Kibi. So let's do this. The big concept change for CLC. Yup. Wow. My girl, Umbin. Mm -hmm. We are CLC. Yes. Wow. I forgot how their outfits ate this era. Yes, yeah. This was when rapper Yan really started popping off. Hey. Oh my gosh, Yujin with the hair, I remember this. This is crazy. Blonde Elki. Like, come on, y'all. Wow, I forgot what she looked like, blonde. Yes, Sony ate. She ate with that, with that look. Sword, the black lipstick. Mm -hmm. I did like her outfit though. Like I really did. Hey, get it. Set her unbend. Yeah, and unbend really ate with the wraps. This comeback, holy shit. Like, vlog! Wow! Yes. Oh yeah, the cat. Wow. I really liked like the neon lights. Like, set, it looks so cool. Like, with Unbin with the cat, like, I love, I love that scene. Like, looking back, all of the sets in this music video gave, like, very much, like, second-gen K-pop. Fuck it up, bro. Yes. I'm sorry, y'all. She's my bias. You know, you know I have to- I have to hype her up. Oh, yes. I loved how that they each had, like, their own bag. Like, it'll, they all look different. Oof! Hey. Yes, oh my god. Mmm. And I love this ending shot. I literally, I think this was the first song I like heard of, like when it came to CLC. Um, 
But like, funny enough, the whole like way I kind of found out about them was I was on SoundCloud, right? I don't know if I've ever told this story before on my channel, but what? So how I found out about CLC? I was on SoundCloud because at the time I didn't have like an Apple Music Premium account. I was like buying the actual songs like individually uh, off of iTunes. Um, now it doesn't even matter. I don't even have an iPhone, but at the time that's what I would do. So whenever like songs would come out that like I liked, but like I didn't have money at the time to buy the songs off of iTunes, I would just search them up and see if someone would put them on SoundCloud and then I would save it to my library on there and then listen to it off of there for free. And of course, like half the time they never had like the correct ones or whatever, but with uh, Hobgoblin, they had, I like heard like a Nightcore version, remember Nightcore, where they would like, like, you know, up the, the tune of like the up the pitch of the voice where it, so it sounded like it was like this really high pitched girl singing it. And then like, they would like speed up the song. That's like what Nightcore was. So it was like, oh, Nightcore version of Hobgoblin. And that's the first time I ever heard it. And I was like, oh, okay. But then when I actually like searched up CLC as a group, I listened to it the actual song and I liked it so much more when it was slowed down it just worked so much better and then that's when I found out about Black Dress and Black Dress had just gotten released at the time so yeah that's my little backstory I don't know if I've ever said that before on my channel but now y'all know how I became or how I found out about CLC and how I'm a fan of them now <laughs> but anyways so yeah so that was Hobgoblin, Dokebi. So now we're gonna be going to the abrupt concept change again uh, to Where Are You, which is Odia in Korean. So let's go. Like I said, I've probably watched this video once, so I really don't know. Wow. I do feel like this song gets shit on a lot though. Like, it's underappreciated. Most definitely. Woo! My girly, starting off. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, I don't remember this. I need to know where they filmed this at, because it looks so pretty. Like, it's really giving 80s. Yes, Sorn. <laughs> yes, girl, get your lines. Get your lines. I love Sonny's voice. Like, Soren, you hate, you hate this era too. So, I know she doesn't really like this era that much, but... Wow. I don't remember like some scenes of this, like where they're on that. What's that thing called? The spinny thing? I don't even know. Hey, yeah. I know they performed this on music shows, but I also kind of forgot they had a choreo for this song. It's been so long since I've seen this video. Wow. Yes. Oh, that was Sonya. Okay, I was like, who? Like, I knew it was Sonya, but like, I was like... Wow. I don't know, something about, like, red and white outfits I just love. Oh, 
does. I'm like, I'm getting, okay, I, I'm getting vibes of like a particular movie, or like series, I'll talk about it. Wow, so nice, I, I love like this retro vibe. Okay, I feel like this song is just so underappreciated. Like it's honestly not that bad, I think it was just the timing wise of it. I was like, why would y'all drop this right after a big girl crush song? I don't know, but... I, I still really like it, but now we're gonna go on to the B side of Freeism, which is actually didn't this like didn't like I like it chart better than Odia? I'm not sure. I can't remember. But we're gonna be checking out the performance video for that next. Hey. I feel like I've seen this like this like basketball court recently. I can't put my finger on where though. I love their outfits though. Mm -hmm. yes. It looks so good. And didn't Sonyeon? Make the choreo for this song? I can't remember. Bestie. Yeah, do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I really like Elkie's hair color there. It's kind of like, I want that hair color. <laughs> hey! Uh-huh. Hey. Get to it. Okay. Got this girl. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's just like a comfort song to me. I don't know, I don't know why it's like it would be a comfort song, but I love it. Uh-huh. I love this bridge. Yes, oh my gosh. Bruh. I know this was just like a simple performance video, but I just love the whole aesthetic of it. I don't know if it's just like the fact that like the 
basketball court is like in the middle of like roads because like you see cars passing by i don't know if it's just that but i just love it their outfits as well i think i think like there's like a lot of things that go into it that I just really like it and like the fact that it's one of my comfort songs which don't ask why but it just is but oh so now we're going to be checking out to the sky and so that'll be our last one for this portion of my clc music video reaction marathon so let's go ahead and close it off with to the sky And I believe this was a uh, pre-release before Black Dress or after. I don't know. Hey. And I want to say Sonyeon and Yujin made the dance for this as well. Bruh, not them dancing like in their company's cafe or like clearly at the time it wasn't yet. <laughs> I love on Ben's earrings, what the hell? I need to get a zoom in on that, I need to see what, what those were. Ooh, that's, that like, transition of them moving was so cool. I mean, like I said, I barely remember, <laughs> I barely remember these performance videos. Okay. Also, another thing, this is when you know something was up because all of them with black hair, like, I don't know. Like nowadays we think of like, oh, different hair colors, come back, but I don't know if it was like that at the time. Hey. Hey. Mm -hmm. Yeah, girls. Hey. Hey. <laughs> I know this is like so simple, but like I love when they had like pink to the sky with like the sky. Oh, it's like cute. Oh, oh, oh okay. Hey. Hey. Okay, okay. Cutesy. Oh shit, I just put the volume up. Whoops. Okay, anyways. But, there you guys go. That was part two of my CLC Music Video reaction. Um, it was nice seeing them, um, you know, seeing these music videos again. Particularly the To The Sky uh, choreography video, as well as the where are you music video those two i don't really remember um so it was nice re revisiting them as well as the songs because it's been a while since i've heard some of the songs as well but uh so next part portion of my marathon with clc is going to be when shit starts going down with black dress no 
me, Devil, um, I don't know if those are like all the ones that are in the next uh, marathon for sure because I think I have a couple other B-side Quarkby videos and stuff mixed in so I think there might be like two more parts at least for CLC but make sure to look out for those. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Follow my social media links in the description below. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.